Welcome to this IQ4NC configuration video. In this video, we're going to configure our IQ4NC to work with Ethernet to trend LAN. Okay, so we're going to get on to configuring our 4NC. So here I have a set project, and as you can see, I've already designed or put together a project. So what I'm going to do is go into Tools, Trend IP Tool, so hit Connect, select the IP address I'm going to be using. Okay, and what we're interested in, of course, is the IQ4 and C. So here it is, and as you can see, it's got a slightly different icon to the rest of the devices to make it stand out as a 4 series controller. Now it's worth just double checking that your IP address is compatible. And as you can see here, it's got an A here, and this A represents automatic addressing. So we know this is going to be compatible for communications. So if we hit the web page button, that will take us to the IQ4 web page. So as you can see, this is greatly improved, very clean interface. So now if we select modules and then go down to networks. And here we have the network configuration screen. As you can see, very, very nice way of doing it, graphically representing exactly what you're going to be doing with your device. OK, so what we're focusing on here is we're going to be doing the Ethernet to trend LAN. So if you select that and what you'll notice here is a lot of the sections have been greyed out. OK, so this is to stop us from making any errors in the configuration. So if we're happy with that, just hit a tick. And what you'll see here is it confirms that it's written to the controller here. OK, so we can close this down. Uh, now we need to create a tour, so a trend universal address. So select the VCNCs, uh, Virtual Communications Node Controllers, and hit Make Tour. So under Make Tour, uh, we're quite happy. We're going to use the IP address. You could use the host name if you wish, but on this occasion, IP address. And this window here just confirms it's been copied to clipboard. OK, so if you just hit OK on that, and we can close IP tool. Now what we're going to do is go into Edit Site Details, which is this house icon. And because we've already created, we don't need to work with the wizard. So just do a drop down, select your 4NC tour. Just quickly just double check the IP address is looking like the one you've just established comms to. So hit OK. And now on your site, right click and hit refresh. And as you can see, it's mapped in the internet network and the local LAN. So we'll just expand on those So refresh again. So it's mapping nice and quick and we'll map in our local LAN. So if we hit refresh, so as you can see, there's our IQ4 and C and those are the 20 milliamp devices, which are now being brought in via the 4 and C. And here we have our ethernet backbone. So if I expand some of these out, then what you can see here is this is a bink. So an IQ3, Bink with three codes attached to it. So it's Ethernet backbone with our 20 milliamp LAN also added to it. Okay, well, thank you very much for watching this video. I hope you've enjoyed it and I hope you enjoy using the NC. Thank you.